Who do you think you're talking to? How can you justify yourself to me? My mother was stabbed in an alley because of you. She bled to death alone in a pile of garbage. So save me your campaign speeches about the great thing. You sound a bit delusional, you know? But then again, who are you? You're a disgraced cop obsessed with her mother's murder. And who am I? I'm a decent man looking out for the little guy. That's who the public sees. And every time they elect me, I'm humbled. I strive harder to live up to that ideal. I want to be that man. And I won't let you or anyone else get in my way. I don't think you're in a position to threaten, Senator. So here's what you don't understand. It's not who has the gun. It's who has the power. Do you really think that's you? I have the file. Smith had another copy. Zero eight six seven two two four one. That's the number of the bank account where you deposited the money orders. So you're right. It is about who holds the power. Now I could release that file and destroy you, but what would that mean for my life expectancy? So here's how it is. The deal that you had with Smith, that's our deal now. And if anything happens to me or anyone that I care about, that file goes public. Am I clear? That's a yes or no question. Yes. And one more thing. Whoever it is you think I am, whatever it is you think you know about me, you have no idea what I'm capable of or how far I will go. I am done being afraid. It's your turn now. That's gonna leave a nasty scar. Every time you see it, think of me. your mom i'll get justice for her just not today till then get it for others <laughs> <laughs>